here to cut the sword for the construction of the Ekumfi Fruits and Juices Company Limited. The first factory to be established under the One District, One Factory Initiative. This is in fulfillment of the pledge I made to the people of Ekumfi on Tuesday, the 1st of November, 2016. As you have heard from earlier speakers, this project has been well planned and well thought out through, with the raw materials needed for the successful implementation of this project already present. President Takufuado brimmed with optimism at the launch of the policy in 2017. Years down the line, official statistics indicate that 104 factories are operational, 24 are the inception stage and 150 are under construction. In all, 224 feasible business plans have been approved. The Greater Accra region has the highest number of projects, 80 factories, and the Northeast region has the least with three projects. Deputy Ranking Member of the Trade and Industry Committee in Parliament, Yusuf Suleimana, provides an assessment of the policy. What I have seen so far is supporting existing companies more than new ones. And that is why if you go to the districts, because the concept is that each district will be given one factory. I can tell you the concentration is in the is in the central region, concentration is in Greater Accra, and concentration is in Eastern region. Traditionally, these are areas that we all know that are into industrialization. What they did was to go back to those areas, support them. Look, let me tell you, a company was given 36,000 Ghana City and put under 1D, 1F. Where would we be able to establish a factory with 35,000 Ghana City? He maintains that there has been a departure from the original intent of the policy. They had wanted to give uh, this uh, hotel, um, Royal Fiesta Hotel, a loan facility. And so I questioned them, and they are to now renege. They are to now move away from it. And so there are many, many tax exemptions they've given to companies that do not deserve it. And many of us have cautioned them, and we told them that, look, we know that there's some underdealings when it comes to these tax exemptions that you are giving to some of these uh, uh, companies. And so me, my assessment is that 1D1F is a total failure. A stakeholder in the industrialization sector the Association of Ghana Industries, AGI, previously called on the government to boost the implementation of the policy as a measure to reduce the importation of goods that can be made locally.